हेलो गाइस दिस इज रेवंस फ्रॉम डिजी इंटीग्रेटिव वेलकम टू टेक न्यूज एपिसोड 141 स्मार्टफोन शिपमेंट्स इन इंडिया फेल 13 परसेंटेज बिटवीन द क्वार्टर वन एंड क्वार्टर टू 2021 टू 32.4 मिलियन यूनिट्स ड्यू टू द सेकंड वेव ऑफ कोविड 19 व्हिच इज स्टिफाइड डिमांड बट बिकॉज़ ऑफ क्वार्टर टू 2020 इज टू मंथ शट डाउन द ईयर ऑन ईयर कंपैरिजन वाज एक्सट्रीमली फेवरेबल विद शिपमेंट्स अप टू 87 परसेंटेज जियोमी रिमेन द मार्केट लीडर शिपिंग 9.5 मिलियन यूनिट्स फॉर द 29 परसेंट शेयर सैमसंग स्टेड इन द सेकंड प्लेस शिपिंग ओवर 5.5 मिलियन यूनिट्स फॉर अ 17 परसेंट शेयर while the vivo came in third with 5.4 million unit ships while realme overtook oppo for fourth place shipping 4.9 million units oppo against 3.8 million units One Plus Note 2 open sale start on July 28th but Amazon Prime members and Red Cable Club members will get access starting July 26th. The One Plus Note 2 base variant is priced at around 27,999 Indian rupees with limited stocks going on sale. One Plus Note 2 specifications include a 90 Hz Fluid AMOLED display, Dimensity 1200 AI chipset, 50 megapixel primary camera and a 65 watt fast charging support. Now let's see about the One Plus Note 2 price in India sale date and launch offers. For 6 GB RAM and 128 GB variant the price in India is around 27999 Indian rupees we will get blue haze color and the sale timeline is on august and if we talk about the 8 GB RAM and 128 GB variant the price is around 29999 it is available in two colors which is called as blue haze and gray saira which is available on july 28th and the third variant which is 12 GB RAM and 256 GB storage which is available in india for rupees 34999 which is also available in two colors which is on blue haze and gray saira is also available from july 28 green woods which is available from august onwards During the launch event of OnePlus Note 2, the OnePlus Buds Pro has also been launched alongside. The premium True Wireless earbuds features hybrid active noise cancellation, Zen Mode Air, Dolby Atmos, Bluetooth 5.2 connectivity and 11mm dynamic drivers. OnePlus Buds Pro price in India has not been announced yet. Poco X3 GT renders reveal a design that is similar to the Redmi Note 10 Pro 5G. The handset has a punch hole cutout and the regular rear camera module. Poco X3 GT specifications may include a 6.6 inch full HD plus display. It comes with a Dimensity 1100 processor and a 64 megapixel primary camera. Twitter says that downwards are not public yet and upwards will be shown as like. The company reiterates that downwards are not dislikes. It appears that the company won't show the downward counts. Realme Book will come in real red, real blue and real apricot color options. It was previously leaked in real grey hue color. The Realme Book price in India is expected to start at under rupees 40000. Xiaomi ran its first MI anniversary sale 2021 India from July 12 till July 16. We had even compiled a list of best deals to help you out for the readers. According to the official statement from the company, it clocked sales worth 1000 crores during this period. The MI 11X series, MI 10i, Redmi Note 10 and Redmi 9 Pro, Redmi 9 and Redmi 9A were some of the best selling devices. Xiaomi India sold over million units of smartphones, smart TVs and ecosystem products during the MI anniversary Sale 2021. Several popular Indian applications and website, including food delivery app and payment app Paytm, among others, were impacted as a part of the global internet outage on Thursday evening. The outage seems to have happened due to the technical issue at Sakamai, which provides Dubai naming system services. Elon Musk stated that Tesla could start accepting bitcoins as a payment soon. The automaker has stopped accepting bitcoins in May due to the energy cost associated with mining it. Elon's announcement caused Bitcoin to cross over 30,000 US dollars that is approximately 2367968 Indian rupees mark. A new report says that Apple has two new MacBook Pro variants in the pipeline. One of them will feature a 14-inch mini LED screen and the other is a 16-inch variant. Both MacBook Pro models are expected to be powered by Apple's M1 Next chipset. Back in June 2019, Google introduced a transit crowd net estimate on its maps that lets you avoid crowds in buses, trains or the subways. That feature was initially available in 200 cities around the globe and now Google is expanding it over 10,000 transit agencies in 100 countries, helping more people find open seats in mass transit or avoid if it is jam packed and wait for another train because social distancing is important during the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic. Google says these predictions are made using 
artificial intelligence technology contribution from Google Map users and historical location trends through the location history data which is kept private using anonymization technology. After announcing a few budget phones like Benko V80 and Z2S, now Lava is in talks to launching its first 5G smartphone. In a discussion with Lava's product head, they have been shared an important insights of the upcoming phone from Lava and its plan for H2 of 2021. As per the discussion, Lava has some big plans for H2 this year. The company has confirmed that it will bring its first 5G smartphone to the Indian market on Diwali. Additionally, the company will bring unique technology in its upcoming phones, which you won't see in any other devices. Micromax E744X has appeared on the Geekbench benchmarking platform. It could launch as a Micromax In2 and Micromax In Note 2 on July 30th. The key specifications include a MediaTek Helio G90 processor, 4GB RAM and it runs on Android 11 OS. Last year, MediaTek announced the Dimensity 800U processor, a variant of the Dimensity 800. Now it appears the Dimensity 1000 will also be getting the U treatment as a leak, as revealed that the Dimensity 1000U phone is coming. The reliable leak stated in a post that a new budget phone is being finalized and its processor is said to be the Dimensity 1000U. Infinix is launching a new smart TV in India dubbed as Infinix 40X1 on July 30th. Ahead of the official launch, Flipkart has listed the key specifications of the Infinix 40X1 smart TV. As per the Flipkart listing, the upcoming Infinix 40X1 television will offer a truly bezel-less design, 350 nits brightness, 24 watt speakers and many more. The Infinix 40X1 smart TV will be available in three sizes which basically include 30-inch HD model, 40-inch variant and a 43-inch model. Hawaii Smart Display for Kids from a leak early this month. The source has listed a number of products Hawaii was scheduled for launch this month. Among them is a smart display and a smart watch for kids. Hawaii already makes tablets for kids, but this will be the first smart display especially for kids. Apart from the fact that it will run Harmony OS out of the box, the device has carried over a feature we have only screen on smartphones and a pop-up camera. The Lenovo Legion 5 Pro is set to launch in India soon, giving gamers yet another RTX 30 series gaming laptop to consider alongside the already launched slew of Asus ROG and MSI Steel and Raider series laptops. The Legion 5 Pro comes to India in the 6th generation avatar now, uses AMD Ryzen 5000 series processor to deliver all the firepower in low. The global configurations that have already been made available reflect on the flavored choice of AMD Ryzen 5000 series CPUs or NVIDIA RTX 30 series GPUs powering the best of the new generation gaming laptops and combined with its potential prices, the Lenovo Legion 5 Pro is said to be an exciting option to consider the gamers. Thanks for watching this video. Please kindly support my channel by giving a like, share and subscribe and follow DG Integrity on Twitter, Instagram and Facebook.